what up though <clears throat> so the clinicals has gotten off to a crazy start already so it's just your ordinary uh clinical day well at least what i that's what i assume uh monday we got clinicals on monday that is our um ob rotation you know we come in she say meet us at a certain spot we meet her at the spot i get in and they don't want us here pretty it, it all in a nutshell the nurses don't want to train us the nurses they're not really feeling it today i don't know what it is for whatever reason they don't want to train us and so she is right now like our clinical instructor is very upset she's been advocating for us so what i think she's gonna do now is try to find us a patient and we can all have um you know that we can have and observe together because what they tried to do is to make us do PCA work. Shout out to the PCAs. But the teacher was like, yo, that's not why we're here. You know what I'm saying? We're not here to do that kind of stuff. We're here to observe and do what the nurses do. That's what you get paid for. And she brought up a lot of good points. She was talking about, um, and that's so crazy because the stuff that we talk about in class, that's on the board. But, uh, I gotta change that. Uh, but anyway. <clears throat> yeah, so she was just pretty much like, no, nah, we're not finna do that. We, we we here to be nurses. You know, that's what you pay for. That's what they get paid for and all that kind of stuff. So she said, y'all going to 45-minute lunch. Not me. I'm taking this time to record some quick content, and I'm getting right back in, the, in that book and start studying. You know, studying. We got an exam next week. And so, But my goal is to have one section mastered by tomorrow. So I can start working on the other stuff and then just keep just it's just simple, just simple repetition, you know, but, you know, I can, you know, my classmates, they go on to get something to eat, which is cool. I can't do that right now because one, I'm fasting and two, if I eat right now and it's only it ain't even it's, it's, it's 830. It's not even nine o'clock yet. If I eat right now and I still got and I'm here to two or three. I'm going to be done. I'm going to be sleepy. I ain't going to feel like doing nothing. So that's, that's, you know, that's pretty much what it is. So right now we up in the teaching in the classroom in the hospital. So it's been an interesting day so far. Interesting day so far for sure. This binder right here, I keep all my notes in this binder. And I bring this binder with me everywhere I go. I bring it everywhere I go because you never know what will happen days like this can occur and now you know we sitting here looking crazy okay well i could be in a book i could be in my notes i could be studying i could be going over quizlet i could be doing all kind of stuff so it's never a wasted moment and never a wasted opportunity to study 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 i don't play them games i bring my notes everywhere everywhere that ain't got nothing to do with nothing if i'm going somewhere i bring them everywhere so Clinical is done right now. We out. We out. We out. Look at Detroit though. Detroit nice. I wouldn't even mind working at my clinical site, no cap. I wouldn't even mind. If anything gonna take me out <laughs> in this program, heaven forbid, it's gonna be this parking garage. Boy, the parking down here is crazy. What up YouTube? It's your man CJ. AKA the High Value Nurse checking in. So week five, um, lecture day slash exam day. So our second exam. And uh I feel okay. You know what I'm saying? Like I, I feel alright. But um, you know, it's a it's a sad day. Well not a sad day, but it's my brother's birthday. And uh, having it having an exam on my brother's birthday is nasty work but you know i'm not using that as no excuse um i prepared as best as i could and we about to find out and see what's what's going on so i'm hoping for i'm praying for a score of a 90 and above um but you know it is what it is one lose a draw we still gonna do what we gotta do keep god first so let's get in here and do what we do, and uh, I'll let y'all in a second. So everybody about to go back to class. 
people be discussing their scores. Not me, said the cat. I mean, I'm discussing with y'all, but that's about it. Let's get back to work. So I just got out. I just got out of my exam, the second exam. <sighs> Bruh. Yo, nursing school, like, this is a beast, bro. I got a 92. I got a 92. I prayed and I asked God for at least a 90. But he surpassed that. And the Lord assisted me with getting a 92. Man, I'm like, bro. I feel a little better. But it's not over yet. We still got that final. So, thank you, Lord. Look, bro, if you're watching me, if you was in that room with me, helping me, I appreciate it. Um, happy birthday. But I'm going to make y'all proud. It's not over yet, though. We got one more to go. It definitely is not over. But I'm I'm happy. Cause I surpassed my last exam by twelve points. Well, twelve percent rather. But I'm definitely happy about that. So I got a nice little break. I didn't I didn't rush, bro. Like cats be wanting you to rush. I, like people be trying to hurry up and take the test early prove whatever but I, that ain't me bro i just i just do what i'm supposed to do and keep it pushing i i do what i'm supposed to do and keep it pushing and um but i will say this test was to me was a lot was easier oh, let me put on my seatbelt up seatbelt on y'all seatbelt on but uh yeah, man, second exam out the way. Bro, I'm, I'm happy about that, bro. Like, but now, you know, I, I'm further, so that gives me a little bit more room, but it's not over, bro. It is not over. And I can't let up. I can't, I can't let up. You know what I'm saying? Like, um, I gotta keep grinding. But I will give credit where credit is due. One of the doctors that's working there, she told us that you want to at least need 20 hours a week of study time. She was not lying, bro. <laughs> she was not lying. So, but I'm happy. I'm thankful. I did my thing. The Lord provided, God guided me. I felt good going into the test. Hey, y'all don't understand, bro. Like, this test was... This test is, uh... It's... It's, it's uh... One of the hardest... classes, one of the hardest classes in the program. It's... I've known this test... I mean, this class to take so many people out. And, uh... But, it, like I said, it's not over. But to do better... Because of that, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, I'm happy about it. So, today, I'm not going to do it. Well, I got to work today, so I'm not going to be doing no studying today. But tomorrow, I'm on it. Um, I'm going to be finishing my project. My part for my project. And uh, really go hard with that. And then I'm back on it for like the next 13, 12 days to get this final out the way. So, I'm about to run home for a minute. Um, tell my girl the good news and then um, go back to class. So I'll let y'all in a minute. So we just getting out of class. Um, today was the last OB lecture. We got one part of a little bit of peace lecture. I don't know why we couldn't have just went over it today and got it out the way. But next week we doing like a big old, I guess, review for the final. 
like a like um like doing games and all that kind of stuff plus we got to present for our presentation so what i'm doing today i gotta go to work so while i'm at work i'll you know i'll you know some downtime i'll start working on my the rest of my project because i already got most of it done um i did the record the only thing i got to do is put in the cues part for when I, for the part of my project i'm supposed to do and that's pretty much it i'm, I'm through and um beyond that it's studying she like i want you guys to study you know for this test like you're taking it next week she said most of it is gonna come from what we talked about today but you know i want you to review stuff that was heavily talked about so they were kind of vague with what really to study for um the final next week but i mean for yeah for the final in two weeks but you know whatever i'm gonna go over everything <sighs> i thought i was gonna be able to ease up because i thought they was gonna give us some clues and work with us but she like i want you to know all this by next week you know and i guess some of the stuff is repetition but um i'm just gonna come up with a study plan on how i'm gonna attack this and uh go from there so decent day all in all time to go to work it's raining out i was gonna go to the car wash but it's raining out but I'm still probably just clean out my car while I got a little time and um yeah man go from there get ready to get get go to work so I'll let y'all in a minute after every exam um I like to decompress I like to listen to something that's gonna make me laugh I try not to do any work uh or like any any school work soon after an exam is over because I just I my my brain need a break for a minute so once that's over um like today only thing i'm gonna do is print out my notes and that's it i'm not gonna i'm not gonna do nothing else but then tomorrow it's on game again it's on game but i just need you know you need you need time to reset your mind you dig what i'm saying you've been focusing on something for two weeks 13 days straight because that's what i did last time but you need that definitely need that a time to restart and, and refresh and all that kind of stuff so that's what i'm gonna do today i'm booking a haircut tomorrow y'all I, I done went five weeks since, since this program started without a haircut that's crazy i don't it's been my look my joint is long right now you know my joint looking kind of crazy but it's long and i don't i never go this long without a haircut but this what nursing school do to you nursing school will do it to you for sure um i'm thinking next week no probably not next week i think after the final after the final we got a two-week break so after the final i think i'm gonna download you world i'm gonna buy you world download you world and uh just start going hard with NCLEX questions you, you feel me you know for those two weeks and then i'll be back on I'll be back on um, my regularly scheduled program with uh, school because next is med surge. After that is psych, and after that is leadership. So after this class over, it'll be you know officially 21 weeks of classes because each class is 21 weeks, but uh, a little bit longer if you include the break because we get two weeks for break. And I think for our Christmas vacation and New Year's, we get like three weeks. So, and we get a, some days off for uh, Thanksgiving. So, that's how that's gonna go. But uh, yeah, man, we just we just walking them down. We just walking them down. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. Like, it has been an experience. People been asking me though, like, has it been? rougher than the R, the LPN program. I mean, I'm only a month in. And I, I'm not going to, I can't say yes because when I was at LPN school, I had no idea what I was getting into. So, it was more so of a shell shock. Now, I got, I mean, I kind of have an idea of what's going on and talking to people and everything like that. You you know what to expect a little bit. So, I get that question a lot. Like, is LPN school or is RN school 
so far harder than LPN school. I will say LPN school, I mean, RN school is a little bit more organized. It's a little bit more of higher thinking, critical thinking. Like, let me not say higher, but I want to say like critical. It, it requires me to critically think more when it comes to, you know, quizzes and exams and all that kind of stuff and answering questions. But one thing that really helps me prepare for tests is answering test questions. So whatever your, however y'all do, you know, take however y'all your textbook is set up. Like if y'all got a program where it's designed for y'all to do test questions and practice questions, I would say do it um, because it's only so many ways they can ask they can ask you a question. And once you start doing practice questions. Uh, you'll get stronger. You'll get stronger in your, in your knowledge and the way you answer them. Because like I said, it's about applying the content. No, Not so much as knowing it. Anybody can memorize, you know, anybody can memorize anything. But it's about how they ask you certain stuff. Is you applying that knowledge. So, and I think that's what makes, you know, nursing school so unique. And, um, oh my God. This oh, hopefully they repainting this. This is oh god. I'm sorry, y'all. I just went to my complex and it looked crazy. They, our complex used to be a beautiful brick color. Now it's so ugly with all this paint falling off. I can't. Oh, this is horrible. It's horrible. But anyway, y'all. I'm about to chill out for a minute before I gotta go to work. I wish I could have. I should have never. I should have told them don't ever schedule me to work on the exam day. So, but I only got three more weeks in this contract left, so I ain't tripping. So now, I look on the schedule today, and they're saying that I'm here through the 4th of November. But y'all literally just said that y'all not renewing me. But they found out very quickly that the staff loves me, uh, the residents love me. I actually come to work, I don't call off, and they have no staff. So, I've already been preparing to leave. I already have another gig. Um, but I told the recruiter, I said, listen, if they wanna play ball, they have to go by my rules. Um, I'm not arguing with nobody about days. I'm not working no more than three days a week. Um, and I can't even start to the end of the month, pretty much the 21st and the 22nd. And you got to wait until my school schedule come back because they still haven't given us our clinical placements for message. So I'm not, I'm not tripping on them. They probably going to say no. And I could, and I asked for more money. So they probably going to say no, which is cool. I'm fully prepared for them to say no <laughs> because you know, it's about to be the holidays, and I'm not working on the holidays. Um, I plan to definitely be out of town, so it is what it is, bro. Like I'm not, I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. So it's crazy how these companies are. They really be trying to like control your life. I'm not the one. I'm not the one. But make sure you get paid. Young nurse get paid. Peace.